many Magic the Gathering players know that there is nothing more exciting than the tedium of double-sleeving your deck. But now, with outer sleeves, you can not only triple the fun, but triple the protection? Triple-sleeving your Magic the Gathering deck might be thought of as excessive by some, but when your commander deck is worth as much as a used 2014 Toyota Corolla, triple-sleeving can really be worth the extra pack of sleeves. Triple-sleeving is actually quite simple. In addition to a pack of card sleeves, you'll also need a pack of inner sleeves and a pack of outer sleeves. For inner sleeves, the top two choices are KMC see Perfect Fits and Dragon Shield Inners. In this channel's evaluation, both are A quality. Always make sure you are using top and not side loading inners. Currently, the two best sleeves on the market are Dragon Shield Mats and Ultimate Guard Katanas. Katanas are excellent quality, though they are often hard to find, and they offer a more precise fit when double sleeving. Dragon Shield sleeves come in a variety of styles, including dual mat, art, brushed, and custom, but recently have had a string of bad batches with quality issues that, while Dragon Shield acknowledged and apologized for, has led this channel to exclusively use and recommend sticking to Dragon Shield mats. For outer sleeves, while there are many varieties floating around, the current highest quality is, overwhelmingly, Dragon Shield outers, currently available in black and clear, and each with a matte back for excellent shuffle feel. In order to achieve max maximum protection when triple sleeving, you need to first sleeve your card in the inner sleeve so that the opening is on the top. You should then sleeve the middle sleeve so that the opening is on the bottom. This is the reverse of double sleeving, but is done so as to sleeve the third and outer sleeve so that its opening is on the top. In so doing, you have created an extra layer of protection for your card, which could only be made stronger by using sealable inner sleeves. Hello? Who's that? It's maximum protection for your cards. In triple sleeving your cards like this, you also create pockets of air that are often very difficult to work out. Many Magic the Gathering players cannot be blamed for simply taking a classic double sleeved card and sliding it into the outer sleeve. What this loses in terms of protection, it gains in terms of time saved and a tighter, flatter deck of cards. For comparison, this is a 100 card double sleeved commander deck, and this is a triple sleeved commander deck. As you can see, the triple sleeved commander deck is much larger. That was the commander. For those who like to use art sleeves, be they Dragon Shield or other brands, clear outer sleeves by Dragon Shield are able to offer protection for the artwork in question and provide a matte shuffle feel. The outside is actually stipled in the same way as the black matte sleeves. And thus, even though this sleeve is transparent, it is still a matte exterior and provides a matte shuffling experience. The future is here. The matte exterior of both the clear and the black outer sleeves creates an excellent shuffle feel, provided you actually can shuffle your commander deck. It's quite smooth, but a handful. Let's see Brian Kibler do that. <laughs> Unfortunately, the average deck box just isn't big enough to fit a triple sleeved commander deck. There are, however, a few exceptional exceptions, such as 
this Sidewinder 133 Plus from Ultimate Guard. Fits snugly. Thick. The Academic Deck Box by Gamegenic, in collaboration with Tolarian Community College, will also fit a triple-sleeved deck, and still have room for additional cards such as tokens. The Academic will be coming to local game stores next year, so you can be sure to ask your local game store to stock the Academic, the deck box of my dreams, my wild, wild dreams about cardboard and cardboard accessories. I hope very much this video has been of some help to you. If you would like a somewhat less tedious guide to double sleeving, you may view that video here. It's one of the most popular and therefore most exciting videos that this channel has ever produced.